next one is for a friend of mine, Mina Gurgis. Um, he's from Egypt. Uh, he's a musicologist. He, uh, he's a man of incredible vision, actually. He starts, he started, a, has started it on and off again, a school called Zambaleta Music School, uh, teaching music from all around the world in the mission. Uh, he's currently working on a project with Nikli Tadero uh, called the Nile Project. Oh yeah, we've got some Nikli fans. Yeah, love Nikli. Yeah, and uh, what they're doing is they're, uh, they just got back, actually. They were traveling up and down uh, the Nile, all 11 Nile Basin countries, collecting musicians, putting them together into, I guess, what amount to a sort of a fusion ensemble, cats from each of those countries, and they're going to plan to record and tour with all of that. Uh, the Nile Project. If you give it a Google, or if you look up by McLeet, you'll you'll learn more about that project. I think they're trying to raise funds, as a matter of fact. Um, yeah. um, also, Mina has been very active socially. Uh, he's been back to. Uh, to hear Square a number of times to lend his voice towards democracy in that country. And he's been active even on the Occupy movement here, lending his voice to democracy in this country. So, uh, yeah, exactly. I'm fully behind this. Um, he said something to me that, that struck me. He said, uh, Egyptians don't merely tolerate, they actually have an appreciation for cacophony. <laughs> I love that. And, uh, and then he went on to describe what Zambaleta means, which is yeah. a little bit of that. It's about a sort of positive, chaotic state. So uh, this song is from Mina. It's called Zambaleta. <laughs> First time that I know what was what was the perfect example. And I 
turn to some different mood. 